Hello and welcome to the Nexus. Today we're going to be having a look at the next gen figures from Playmates. But which one are we going for? Let's take a look. So we're going to be looking at the man himself, Sir Patrick Stewart, or as we all know him as Captain Jean-Luc Picard. Uh, we have a really nice picture here of Picard. Which is nice, some good accessories. The same on the back. <laughs> uh, these ain't going to change. Um, we've got the Enterprise D as well up the top. But look, let's, let's not wait around. Let's crack this open. Okay, so here is Captain Picard out of packaging. Uh, once again, we come with the Delta, no name plate as always. The stand is pretty, uh, pretty generic, I think the stands are now. Uh, it comes with a tricorder. In the right position this time a lot of uh, sculpting i remember do you know um if you've ever clicked the original playmates figures you will know that they came with these lines on the backs uh that is for better grip so um let's put it in picard's hand and he does hold it really well i think it's a little bit too big they should have been a little bit smaller but um yeah so just like the Riker one once again i don't know why data's one's straight or got one thingy on it it also comes with a pad which once again is slightly different than the one that came with Riker, as in on the back there once again card holds that really well uh in that hand uh, and we come with the Type 1 phaser. So the Type 1 phaser is this little pocket one. Um, and they've supplied him with this. So I don't know why. Uh, he ain't going to fit in that hand. And I don't think it's going to fit in this one either. Because it's got this big chunky part on the end. And you wouldn't hold it right near the emitter. At the front. So... Oh, I don't know, you might be able to hold it in this hand. Yeah. Okay, so you can hold it in that hand. Cool. But that's how he's supposed to hold it like this. Though I think it's a bit close to the beam, if I'm if I, if I'm not mistaken. It's far close. Uh, get his hand chopped off. Uh, and it also comes with one of this. Now, I remember having these as a kid. Uh, and this is like, so I say, this is like soft plastic. It, it comes off, but it's sort of like a... A softer plastic than it would have been normally now as a kid um out of the star trek magazines what i would do is cut a little picture and i'd put it on there but what also annoyed me was they never brought a desk out for picard or any of the characters that's supposed to have one so you had trouble sort of placing this so i'm hoping with this time around we get a um a little desk for him maybe his ready room that would be cool um for him um, and then we could place this on, on the, on the desk with his pad and a cup of Earl Grey maybe. Uh, but that's that, that's this standard, um, sort of, um, sort of, I don't know, laptop, I would say. This is all before laptops are even a, a thing, you know? Um, but that's his little desk computer that he has. And this is the man himself. And I've got to say, yeah, it's really nice. Really, really nice. Um, let's take a closer look. At it. And I've got to say, uh, up close, it's not great. But I'll tell you what, further, I mean, you can tell it's Picard. You can tell that it's, it's Picard. Nice paintwork, especially on the pips and around the collar. Because you, uh, you can really tell from a distance um, that that is Captain Picard. Which is what you want. Uh, we have the same information on the back here. The, oh, that gibble. On the back. Uh, once again, articulation is the same. They're using these ball joints, which they didn't really take advantage of when they uh, first came out. But now, um, the range that you can get. Once again, you don't have that, that sort of waist movement on these. Um, I love the fact that the hand's a little bit up, like he's saying, engage. So engage, I like that. <laughs> uh, Standing-wise, yeah, he can hold himself 
standing and the camera's looking up i know but um standing wise you can stand really well uh once again we have these numbers on the front uh, on his feet once again we don't know what they mean or what they are just there and uh picard can stand yeah well really well um yeah i'm really happy with this one as well and then um you know overall i think the next gen ones are okay i think data is the, the worst one i've got you know if i had to choose one i'd have to say it's the worst one um but you know early doors and i think for uh for the start of the collection this is right at the very start i think it's all right i think it does all right it's a good start. It's a good start. A very good start. Um, but look, let me know what you think in the comments. I think the accessories are really good as well. But look, like I said, let me know what you think in the comments uh, down below. And I've been Kev for the Nexus. And as always, we'll see you at the next video.